Close to starting time, less than a minute. Six pack of Pacers lining up behind the starting gate for tonight's second race, the Tony Morello final. Gates rolling at Hawthorne. Here they come. They're up and pacing. Fox Valley Exploit going for the lead. Scorecard Dandy driving out towards the inside. Dune Dame trying to hold position. My Uptown Girl is fourth in fifth. Skeeter Machine rolling cold six as they make their way around the turn and go on to the back stretch. Scorecard Dandy moving quickly now to take the lead. And they begin their journey on the back stretch. Scorecard Dandy settles on top. Fox Valley Exploit second. Dune Dame is third. My Uptown Girl, Skeeter Machine, and Roland Cole, the trailing trio. The quarter went in 28 and 2. And on the mid back stretch they go. Scorecard Dandy in control. Racing in second position. Fox Valley Exploit in third after three eighths of a mile. Dune Dame. Then it's My Uptown Girl, Skeeter Machine, and Roland Cole. There's been no change in position. They're in line as they drive over to the half. Scorecard Dandy leads the way. Right there in second is a strong Fox Valley exploit. Dune Dame third. Then it's my Uptown Girl, Skeeter Machine, and Rolling Cole. Half and 56 and four, and they move around the turn. Scorecard Dandy going along at a comfortable pace. They're in the final three eighths of the mile. Scorecard Dandy leads. Fox Valley exploit second. Up on the outside, here comes my Uptown Girl third. Dune Dame now has no place to go fourth. Rolling Cole moving up on the outside fifth. Skeeter Machine shuffle the sixth. Around the turn, they're in the stretch. Three quarters, 125 and three. It's Scorecard Dandy leading a length and a half. Fox Valley Exploit drives from the pocket second. Then on the outside, my Uptown Girl towards the inside. Dune Dame rolling Cole on the far outside. Looking for racing room, Skeeter Machine. A 16th to go, Scorecard Dandy with Fox Valley Exploit closing on the outside. Here comes Fox Valley Exploit to win it. Fox Valley Exploit beat Scorecard Dandy, and then it was My Uptown Girl third, tight for fourth. The 2022 Tony Morello final goes to Fox Valley Exploit in 152 and four. In tonight's second race, two, Fox Valley Exploit finished first, four, Scorecard Dandy second, three, My Uptown Girl third, one, Dune Dame fourth, two, four, three, one is posted, it's unofficial, 152 and four. <laughs>
Now returning the unofficial winner to Fox Valley Exploit. She is owned by Dave Brigham and Kyle Husted. Amy Husted, the winning trainer. Kyle Husted, the winning driver. Fox Valley Exploit, an Illinois bred five-year-old mare by Sportsmaster out of the, the big dog mare. She likes it all. Fox Valley Exploit, bred in Illinois by Fox Valley Standard Breds. Congratulations to trainer Amy Husted, who just took out her training license this year, and she gets her first win on our Night of Champions here tonight. Not the first win of the beat. She's won multiple times, but her first win on Night of Champions. So we congratulations to the Hoosteds. The second race is official. Return prices and rundown in a moment. Let's go down to the winner's circle. Here's Jim Miller. Kyle Husted and a special guest down here. And uh, Kyle, the little one's joining us tonight. Wants to check out the mic. You got something to say? <laughs> Should have a lot to say tonight. I mean, talk about this race. Scorecard Dandy's a horse that has really kind of been battling you all season long. And it looked like tonight tried to slow things down a little bit to the half, but you had just enough left in the lane. Were you a little bit worried early on? I was really worried on, you know, even before the race. Scorecard Dandy's been tough. You know, she's beaten me a couple times. Um, I'm just glad for once I was on her back. And I'll tell you tonight, you did have very good position early on. And then rolling Adam late, just able to get up in time. But overall on the meet, just talk about the job that you guys have done, your wife Amy has done. You guys have had a very good meet, a very successful meet, and it's one of those things where really it is a family operation for you. Yeah, no, my wife does a good job. We have a couple people that work for us back there. They do a great job as well. Um, you know, as everybody back there knows, my wife is the, the person in charge and the, the backbone of it all. Um, you know, and it shows with a horse like Exploit, it's hard enough to win these races once, let alone four times. Yeah, and I'll tell you, an exploit's the horse that's been very solid, just very consistent each and every time out. You look at these type of races and that, do you have to have a strategy from the start, or is it just kind of see how things unfold and then go from there? Uh, I kind of just fly by the seat of my pants. A lot of times, uh, you know, guys that drive with me kind of realize that. Um, but for her, she's she doesn't like slow fractions, and, you know, thankfully Kyle didn't, didn't walk us around there. Yeah, and the horse turned out really good, and I'll tell you, you have a nice little guest there, so congratulations, Kyle. <laughs> Thank you. Kyle Houston, winning driver.